was interested in computer science because I was interested in like puzzles and problem solving and I wanted a career with that kind of logical thinking. My research area is in the area of cybersecurity and cryptology. So I'm a cryptographer by training. So basically my research is in the area of how to secure communication over the public channel. Um, I think my favorite part of the degree would be how hands-on it is. And um, instead of just learning the theory behind um, coding or hacking techniques, you're actually hands-on in a lab working with other students and your lecturers. Basically, our principle is uh, we want to equip students with a hands-on experience. So we, the students actually do not study theoretical basis, but they will go to the lab, they make their hands dirty to make sure that they can uh, practice once they finish. Then we want to make sure that they are job ready and once they conclude their study, they can directly go to industry. Uh, so the work I did in clubs and societies gave me the skills and experience to secure a scholarship with um, Google, which took me on a trip to Southeast Asia. There are a few range of scholarships available for students. Uh, these are basically sponsored by industry and we encourage our high achiever students to apply for that and then uh, the scholarship will be able to help them to study. As a cyber professional, I get to work across a lot of different types of industries and that can take me all across the world. ICT is a very high demand at the moment and also uh, our students are basically, they will get job before even they finish. I've just started a graduate position in cybersecurity and I'm um, at the moment I'm going through rotations of different areas. Something I didn't realize about cyber is that it's not just hacking or it's not just one particular thing. There's a lot of different areas within cyber and at the moment I'm moving between them and finding out what I like and I'm excited to specialise. ICT is always changing from time to time. So what we learn today is different from what we will need to learn tomorrow. So as, uh, effectively, actually our principle is we want to teach students how to learn for the future. The reason I went into computer science is because I was interested in a job that would be that would keep changing and keep being challenging. You have to be very passionate with this uh, profession. So effectively, we do not really need students who know with the state of the art of what's happening in technology, but the students have to be passionate in what they will be doing.